Hello, beloved people of God. It is Deja. Welcome and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you all so much for being here. If you're not already subscribed, I highly suggest you do you doing so and turn on your bell notifications. That way you may be notified every single time that I post. By subscribing to this YouTube channel, that means that you're coming into agreement and partnership with the prophetic words and teachings that are underneath this ministry. So go ahead and do so. Give this video a very big thumbs up for me and share this word with somebody who needs to see it. Um, I have missed you guys. I've been gone. Like I said in my previous video, I've been gone for a few days, but I'm back and uh, I'm excited to deliver these words to you. Glory be to God. So in today's word, glory be to God, the Lord is saying, do not settle. Glory be to God. Do not settle. And so um, I was just in worship with the Lord the other day, just worshiping God, praising him, thanking him for everything. And um you know, a lot of us are still waiting for the promises of God in our lives to come to pass. Amen. You, a lot of you believe and you know that it's super close, but you're not seeing them happen just yet. And you're wondering what's going on. Why haven't I seen this promise in my life come to pass yet? Well, the Lord began to just, um, I began to kind of, even for myself with certain things, I had began to ask the Lord, like, you know, Lord, what's going on? And um, there was an opportunity that had arose to me. And it wasn't the opportunity that I had been believing God for. Um, and so, um, you know, I know that sometimes, I know this word is for some somebody. I know that sometimes when we're waiting to get out of a situation and into something better um that waiting can sometimes be so excruciating that we want to get out so bad that we sometimes settle for something less than what god has for us and beloved i've come on here to tell you today from god do not settle god wants to bless you but he does not want you to settle he wants you to endure and so i was i was i began to like do some research and do my homework and the lord sh showed me on the clock 10 10 and i'm like all right lord you've been showing me this number for a while and i'm like okay lord now what scripture and he showed it to me that day when i was like kind of questioning lord would you want your children to settle you know what i mean like settle in the sense like be okay with this for now even though it's not the promise and um the lord brought me to after doing a little bit of research and also um incorporating the 10 10 because that the lord had been showing me 10 10 and god brought me to john 10 uh john chapter 10 verse 10 and i want to go ahead and read that for you guys so john 10 chapter no john chapter 10 verse 10 reads the thief comes only in order to steal and kill and destroy i came that they may have life and have it in abundance to the full till it overflows and that's the amplified version and that's literally from the mouth of god that is jesus christ himself speaking and he is saying in this scripture glory be to god the enemy is going to try and talk you out of and try and take away from, try to destroy, try to, to hinder, try to hinder the blessings, the promises, the walk, the life that you have with God. He's trying to steal the things that belong to you. He's trying to steal the things that are inheritances to the children of God, steal their promises, steal their breakthrough, steal their joy. And um, the Lord is saying, I have come. Glory be to God. I have come. A take heart because I have come to give you life and give it more abundantly till it's full until it overflows. The Lord wants to give you, beloved, an overflowing cup of joy, of an anointing, of gifts, of blessings, of hope, of, of an inheritance. He wants to give you an overflowing cup. So, beloved, if you've ever wondered, should I settle for this? It's not what God has for me. It's not what he promised me. But should I settle? I hope that this is your answer. I hope this answers your question. No. <laughs> Do not settle. Because God has so much better for you. And he wants to bless you with that. And he really does delight in blessing the children who have waited. And glory be to God. I see a butterfly. Let me see if I can flip my camera. Oh, where'd it go? <gasps> I can't even. It's like way over there now. Sorry, I just wanted to show you guys that because butterflies, especially white butterflies, they represent blessings from the Lord. So, um, glory be to God. It was just confirmation here and there. I'm in nature right now. I'm at a park. Um, 
And so, yeah, I just wanted to deliver that quick word to you guys. Deliver that quick word to you guys and let you all know that do not settle because God has so much in store for you, especially for those who wait. Um, a lot of us kind of give up right before the breakthrough and we settle for something that's not the the top of what God the the epitome of what God has for us it's not the fullness of what God has for us so I want to encourage you today beloved do not settle God is going to come through with the promises that he has for your life and I'm not saying that there are not stops along the road where the Lord will take you in order to get there so make sure you pay attention to that too but also just know that God would not have you settle all right so I love you all so much I appreciate you guys so much for supporting this channel this ministry again if you feel led to sow into this word or into my ministry God bless you I'm praying over every single seed I love you all so much if you're not already subscribed go ahead and subscribe turn on your bell notifications that way you're notified every single time that I post Go ahead and give this video a very big thumbs up for me. Share this word with somebody who needs to see it. If you are not going to settle and you're in the in it for the long run until you have that overflowing cup from the Lord, go ahead and comment down below John 10 10. All right. I love you all so much. And you have a very blessed day.